Texas. There's only 22 days left until Election Day, but starting tomorrow, you can cast your vote early. A lot of states have been, had a hard time finding poll workers, but Texans have showed up and showed out to help. 25 News reporter Paige Ellenberger shows us why many say working the election is the American thing to do. In a survey done by Pew Research, about 6 in 10 poll workers in the 2018 midterm elections were over the age of 60. Now with COVID posing a threat to that demographic, many places have sought after young people to step up and help work elections. We have had a lot of people call in and ask to work. So, so far, you know, we're in good shape with workers, but each day changes. We, you know, never know what tomorrow is going to bring. Party chairs in Bell County look to fill a few hundred spots each election, but they say the interest they received this year has turned out greater than previous years, even calling it shocking. We were very concerned with the primary runoff, being able to have enough workers, and it's just been a, a, a great source of pride uh, to see so many people step up. And you may think the surge of mail-in ballot requests would take the stress away of finding workers, but that's not the case. We expect to see people waiting for us to open the doors, and so it's always presidential elections is our highest turnout, but we do expect to see probably about 65 percent of our registered voters vote during this election. In fact, poll workers have a new job this election. Disinfecting voting equipment has become a necessary task. We're asking our poll workers to step up to uh, be sanitation workers. We have to make sure that we're providing a safe environment for voters and everybody in the, the polling location. Those measures include extra sanitation and workers providing caps for voters index fingers for a touchless experience. Also, Central Texans can fulfill their vital role in American democracy. I really want to say how proud I am as an American and as a Texan to see so many people participating in 2020. This has been a, a difficult year for everyone, and this election is the most important election of our lifetimes. Voting early experts say will help you avoid those long lines many of us expect to see on Election Day due to a COVID extended ballot with some local races never before seen on a presidential ballot. In Belton, Paige Ellenberger, 25 News. Paige, thank you. Election workers do a lot more than just sanitizing equipment. They work extremely long hours setting up polling stations and securing them after closing each night. Election clerks also drive materials to and from polling locations, process ballots, equipment and paperwork, and they also answer questions voters might have. And of course, they also check IDs and assist with voter equipment. 